Alright, I recently watched this video about electric bikes and their batteries catching on fire. Here, take a listen. If you bring in a non-name brand bike for repairs, prepare to pick it up before they close for the day. We will not keep that e-bike in our store overnight because we have no idea about the battery. Dragon is worried about poor quality lithium ion batteries that can become unstable and catch fire. He says they're associated with lower-priced e-bikes and e-scooters. If the bike is so cheap that it's too good to be true, it's so cheap for a reason, and the battery is the primary cost on a lot of those bikes. As e-bikes have grown more popular, battery fires have become more frequent, and concern is growing. Fire officials from New York to Vancouver are reminding the public of potential dangers. This weekend, those dangers turned deadly in the downtown east side. A fire erupted at the Empress Hotel, a single-room occupancy building. Uh, investigations uh, uh, determined that uh, it was a battery from an electric bike. One person died after they fell from a second-floor window and two others were injured. Officials say the battery was overcharged and modified, something people do to make it last longer, a dangerous move, according to experts. Uh, Lithium-ion batteries have limitations as to how quickly you can take energy out or put energy back in. If you take it out faster than the, the cell is capable, it overheats. If you put it back in faster than the, the cell can accept that energy, it overheats. His advice is to always use the same charger that came with your device and charge in a place where you can get away safely if anything does happen. While the risk of fire is low, Dragon is still careful with his instructions to customers. Start Okay, so first off, this might just be me, but in the beginning they were talking about lower quality, cheaper e-bikes, i.e. cheaper lithium batteries being dangerous. And then when they started talking more about it, it shifted to uh, modifications and not charging it properly. And then you had that science guy saying um, it can only accept power and uh, use power at a certain rate and if you try to accelerate that you increase risks of hazards so again this might just be me but if lithium is dangerous uh, charging it too quickly or using the energy too quickly what exactly does that have to do with cheaper batteries I know cheaper batteries are lower quality but that science guy was saying that's lithium if you charge it too quickly, you increase risk. If you use the energy too quickly, you increase risk. Higher quality batteries might be safer, but the problem still persists, right? That's what I heard from that science guy talking about lithium. So yeah, if lithium has such a danger with dispensing the energy and recharging the energy into the battery, is it really a good idea to have them in all electric vehicles? like it says in this picture up here. Anyway, that's the end of my quick little ramble. Take care.